catch up and get ahead with The Edge for the week of February 22nd. Have you voted yet? If not, hurry up, because early voting for the March 1st primary election ends on Friday, February 26th. During early voting, you can vote at locations across Bear County. Go to Nowcast SA and use our free mobile-friendly map to find the polling place nearest you. The newest early voting place, added just this year, is the University of Texas at San Antonio main campus. And you don't have to be a student to cast your ballot there. But of course, that means roadrunners have no excuse not to get out and vote. And that goes for you too, Rowdy. Nowcast SA has received a $6,000 grant from Google Fiber to conduct a pilot program to help students in San Antonio public housing build versatile computers for free and to teach them digital media literacy skills. The education effort falls under the Connect Home Initiative, announced last year by President Barack Obama and Housing and Urban Development Secretary Julian Castro. Connect Home hopes to give children living in poverty a free lift across the digital divide. As this illustration from the White House Council of Economic Advisors shows, the areas of San Antonio where most people do not have high-speed internet are also the areas of greatest poverty. Google pledged to give free internet access to people in public housing in every Google Fiber City, and that includes roughly 6,000 families in San Antonio. Schools oftentimes are really good at providing technology, um, but what we've come up against in the past, um, in which the president rem remarked in specified in his remarks is the homework gap, right? So it's a student that's being assigned a homework assignment, but once they get home, they don't have any way to complete that. I think the statistic now is that more than 80% of the homework assignments that are being assigned throughout the United States should be completed online. So Connect Home is a... We will try to deal with... Now Cast SA has several webcasts coming up, and you won't want to miss them. On Tuesday, February 23rd, Make sure to join us in the latest in the Dean's Distinguished Lecture Series, a presentation by Dr. Iris Carlton Linnae on African American social welfare pioneers responding to community needs. Thanks to the underwriting support of the UTSA College of Public Policy, anyone can watch live or replay the video later. On Saturday, February 27th, we will webcast Councilman Ron Nuremberg's State of the District event, where he will present his policy priorities for 2016 and beyond. The event will also feature a panel discussion with distinguished experts on the future of transportation in San Antonio. Thanks to sponsorship support from Security Services Federal Credit Union and Councilman Nuremberg, anyone can watch live or replay the video later. Black History Month is a good time to go back and revisit some of Nowcast SA's archive videos including our webcast of author, professor, and political strategist Donna Brazil's visit to the San Antonio Carver Cultural Community Center. While you're there, check out our mini documentary on the Carver Center, whose story goes back more than 100 years during a time of segregation. It was first known as the Carver Colored Library, a library, a social center, and a place of refuge. Now seeing black college presidents, not just on HBCU campuses, but, of course, up north, Brown University, the Ivy League campuses. Dr. King would have been excited to have seen Shirley Chisholm run for the president, Jesse Jackson, one of his lieutenants, and yes, Dr. King would have been excited to be invited to the White House to see not just the first black president, Bill Clinton, but the second one, <laughs> Barack Obama. Thanks for watching The Edge. See you next time.